guys this is varsha and you are watching mastermind so friends in this session we are going to discuss the important questions from the third chapter of biology that is heredity and genetics and friends we have already uploaded a video on the important questions from the first and the second chapter of biology so if you haven't watched that video then you can watch it from the link provided in the description box of this video and friends all these questions which we are going to provide you are from the model test papers of many different books which are published as per the latest CISCE curriculum for 2019 and friends our main motive of preparing these videos is to help you to revise and make sure that you be in touch with all the topics chapter wise and subject wise and all these questions are important for your board exams 2019 So without wasting much of our time let us begin So friends number 1 is what is dihybrid ratio So it is 9 is to 3 is to 3 is to 1 Next question who is known as the father of genetics So it is Mendel but you need to write the full name it is Gregor Johannes Mendel Next question the scientific name of the plant in which mendel conducted his experiment so it is pisum sativum Next question which law of mendel explains the dihybrid root ratio sorry it is ratio So it is mendel's third law and the name of the law is law of independent assortment next question what is the genotypic ratio so it is 1 is to 2 is to 1 next question wh what is the phenotypic ratio so friends it is 3 is to 1 Next question name two diseases caused by the recessive alleles located on the x chromosome so it is hemophilia and color blindness Next question a specific part of a chromosome that determines hereditary hereditary characters so it is genes next question what is mutation so friends mutation is a sudden change in the structure of this gene or in the number and structure of chromosomes that has not been existed in the parents next question why did mendel select pea plant for conducting his experiment so friends this is very important This question is repeated most of the time in your board exams. So the answer is pea plants have several varieties and pea plants bear bisexual flowers and that is each flower has both the male and the female parts and this is uh, there is self pollination self fertilization in pea plants due to which it is easy to get pure lines for several generations. Thanks for watching this video. Please do subscribe to us and give the thumbs up button. And if you have any queries related to your board exams, then you can write to us in the comment section.